Hi, my name is Sarah. Um, I had done already a previous video on decorations for Diego um, birthday party theme. Today I'm going to be going over how to make a cute, um, very simple and very cheap centerpiece. So if you want, um, just keep watching and I'll show you how I did it, okay? Okay, and this is actually one of the first items um, you have to get. These are cute little buckets and they're in different colors. I got these in Target and they're very small, they're very cute and they're actually a dollar each so they're very cheap in the dollar aisle so this is the first item we need, okay? The second item, it's actually some foam balls. Um, they're kind of hard, so they're really not just any type of foam. I really don't know what it is. It shows, um, if you can see it, I don't know what it's called, but um, they're, it says $4.77. They're actually $3.99 at Hobby Lobby, um, and we'll be using this in a bit. We also need, and you might be wondering why in the world I am in the restroom. The restroom is actually the only quiet place <laughs> because I have a one-year-old, well, almost one-year-old, that is already walking and if he sees me in the kitchen or in the living room, he's going to be yelling and he's going to be trying to grab everything since he walks now. Yeah, so he thinks he's cute. Well, he is cute, but... And this is the second thing we will need. I'm pretty sure you're all familiar with it. Um, you use these for birthday parties, especially if you're Hispanic. You know definitely what this is. So you'll need just about one or two. Um, I like green because this is going to give the grass touch to it, okay? So that's that. And what else? If you have a glue gun, you will need a glue gun. Um, you will definitely need a glue gun on this. And you also need these sticks. They're very uh, thin. They almost look like spaghetti, but I'm pretty sure you've seen it. Sometimes they use it for cooking uh, and barbecue. Um, or just some, I really don't know what it's for, but this is what it is, and it has a little pointy touch right in the, right here, so be careful on that. So I bought the whole package because you will need a lot of these. Okay, and then the second item, uh, the, the second item, the, ne the next thing I need, um, let me see, if you see this board, I did a bunch of little ones, I did orange, I did green, and you can do a, I mean, based on whatever color you want, and you'll eventually cut them. If you buy the number ones, it's more expensive, so that's just to save money. And if you're wondering how in the world I got these cute little foam animals, I have three designs. This is one, this is two, and this is three. So this is really beautiful. You see the little eyes? That's really cute. So that's cute. And I'll show you these. I got them at Walmart. And I'll be posting a picture of the box, how it looks like. It's really cheap. You can make actually, I think, 20, 20, 24. 24 of these. Um, 24 total. So in total, I have 24 animals um, for about $3.99. 3 or $4. So that's that. And um, let me go grab something and I'll be right back. Okay. So these are pictures that I'm planning to put on the centerpiece. And if you see the wallet size, that's my husband and my baby in the Miami Zoo. Uh, and if you see the animal there is the Okapi, Okapi animal. This one, this one's my favorite. And believe it or not, my son is in there. His little face is in there. There you go, there he is. <laughs> and then the last one is the hippo. He's on it as well. So cute. Okay, so those are, I'm going to be using and I'll show you how I'm going to be using them, okay? Eventually I'm going to cut them and then I'm going to, I'll show you. Okay, so that's that. And Okay, so here I'm going to show you how to start. We're going to grab the bucket first and um, let me make this a little more elevated so you can see it, okay? Give me one second. Okay, so I put this box so you can see the bucket at this level, okay? So I'm starting with the bucket. I'm just grabbing any advertisement. Um, and I'm just going to tear the page, okay? And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to crumple it. I'm going to stick it in here so we won't have to um, use confetti. So I'm going to squeeze it in here enough at the bottom to make room for the, the foam. And now, 
we're going to do the foam. So I'm going to put this inside. Okay. And we're going to make it squeeze in there. Let's see. And now... Okay, sorry, I had to plug my charger. It was already giving me the warning sign. Okay, so now I'm putting the ball here. If the if this is too much, you can just adjust it. So I think I did put too much. So I'm going to put it here in the bottom. And now that I already have these made, I'm going to go ahead and just stick them here. So I'm going to put this in the middle. Well, not in the middle, but towards the end. And you see how this falls? So a good idea is gonna that's gonna help it stay i'm gonna go ahead and glue and use the glue gun so i'm gonna pretend like i'm doing it so let's see okay so i already glued the ball to the piece of paper right underneath it and i already put these two and i just insert them um i just put them right through and i did two i don't want to do too many because i'm gonna use 12 buckets um so since i have 24 of these I'm going to be using two um, in each bucket, so um, I would use three, but it would just seem like too much and I would run out. So what I'm doing, remember the picture I showed you earlier about my baby? Okay, well I went ahead and cut this picture um, and I cut the number one that I had in the big poster board and I went ahead and de did this. So you see, I have my little animal with my baby <laughs> and the number one and I already glued it. So this is just glued um, and I go ahead and insert it right in the middle and you can adjust it. You can either push it down or move it up higher, however you wish. And now that this is already stable, I'm going to go ahead and use this. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and just cut whatever amount I wish um, and just stick it in here to give that the, let's see, and if it keeps moving then I guess I'm going to have to put more glue. And as that goes, so I'm going to use a little more. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to use a little more glue so it can stay together. Okay, so it's going to take a while to dry. But after it's dry, we should be done. So if you see here, let me move it just a bit to the white background. You see how beautiful it is? And if you see the bucket, and look, it gives it that grass. Or if you have, um, if you don't want to use these, feel free to buy the imitation of grass, which is a little more expensive. It's more like a confetti, but it's going to look a lot prettier. So I'm still debating. If I don't like how it looks, I'm going to go for the confetti, which is a little more expensive probably three bucks or two, three, I mean, depending on where you go. But I did see them in Hobby Lobby. They were just, they just ran out of green. So I'm going to try to go back if I don't like it, but I'm actually liking it. So this is what the centerpiece will look like. And if he's turning one, two, three, you can make the number there that you cut. Um, but that's my little cheetah. And then on the next one, I'm going to be using, instead of the lion, I'm going to be using the elephant. So either way, I'm going to have, um, you see, you see how beautiful? I'm going to be having two animals with a picture. Um, so the next one, I'm going to be using this picture, but I'm going to have to cut it, which I don't have it ready. But if I cut this picture here, just about this section in a circle in some sort of shape, I'm going to put this right in the middle. So it's going to be looking very cute. And what I'm going to do as well, I'm going to write here in this little space, I'm going to put Caleb's. Um, and his last name or just Caleb's first birthday so you can make it however you wish and there you go you have a cute simple yet very inexpensive centerpiece thank you for watching and I'll be posting the pictures of every item um, that I bought so you can have an idea how the box looks like just in case you don't know how to find it or where to find it and that is it thank you so much bye bye